Well, I do love that footage of Dermy getting up in slow motion. I think there's yeah. a, some documentary I've seen, and as he's running away, he's vomiting out all the fluid. That's in, it's unbelievable. Broken Maybe ribs. A little, is there a little bit of mayo on, I, on Dermy? Well, like Dermy. He knows the cameras <laughs> were on him, but if he's coughing blood, you can't say there's no What's mayo on that. that. There's so many great moments in, in finals, grand finals especially. What's your favourite moment in any grand final Mate, that you've ever seen? so many, but yeah. one that stands out to me and is easily the best is Mark Yates hit on Dermot Purden in the 89 grand final. That yeah. is Dirty. the number one Dirty. <laughs> start of a grand final. You know, Dermy was known for coming off the line and, you know, kind of taking people, not taking people out, but, you know, giving them a good hip and shoulder mm. and for them to target Dermy to kind of set the scene, but that hit hit it was just it was sickening to watch. It was. it was getting goosebumps now, just thinking about. It. I was a Hawthorne supporter, oh, you're of, a yeah, growing up. So that's why you're going for that that's, moment. That's um, easily the moment. Of, you're about ready of to jump down the television screen oh, and smash mate, it. Right it was <laughs> it was good, and you think about it now, can just you, you can picture it. Yeah. You know, beautiful beautiful day, hundred thousand people, and then first bounce, yeah. whack. You know, I'm bringing this up now because my favourite moment would have been. <laughs> well, any grand final is that wonderful ball that bounced the wrong way in the 2010 grand final. Ain't I a stinker? It's just amazing it's... drama. He, I was on the edge of my seat. Of course, I wanted Secure to win. You've won one premiership in the past, and that was determined by a point. No time left on the clock. The ball goes into a wide open forward 50. There's Stephen Milne, ready to cover himself <laughs> in glory. Do what he does best, which is just to work some angles, and all the ball has to do is do what it would do 99 times out of 100 and bounce back at you. But it, it, sounds, it sounds good, <laughs> but if you think of the psychiatric of Mark Yates during the week, he'd come and nailed it to a tee. Like, Dermy was coughing blood. Yeah. Like, he just hit him straight yeah. down the middle. Yeah. Like, if you think of it like that, it's easily the number one. Like, oh. easily. Like. Well, I do love that footage of Dermy getting up in slow motion. I think there's yeah. a, some documentary I've seen. And as he's running away, he's vomiting out all the fluid that's in. It's unbelievable. Broken Maybe a little, is there a little bit of mayo on, I, on Dermy? I know like, Dermy. He knows the cameras <laughs> were on him, but if he's coughing blood, you can't say there's no mayo on that. But. Doing it for the crowd, no. doing it for the telly, and then... No, that's a dirty dog move. It's, it's all about the drama of a drawn grand final. I mean, jeez. And and then the drama of the ball going out, and, and it wasn't your fault. All right, it wasn't your fault. Yeah. It was Lenny's fault. <clears throat> we'll just leave it at that because Lenny's not here. But then we go, what's going to happen now? The siren's gone, and do we have extra five minutes oh, each no one way? knew what was going no on. No one knew what was but... going on. Everyone's just walking around there. Nicky Maxwell's going off at the, the head of the AFL. Yeah. This is just, this is unbelievable. What were you thinking? Man, I was thinking about Yates and Dermy again. <laughs> nah. um, that's all I was thinking about. Dermy telling the boys, you know, I'm the man, I, I won us that grand final. I took the hit, no one else took the hit. You kick the next three or four, a couple of big clunks, mm. strutting down to the, you know, the goal square and, yeah. you know, telling his mates that, you know, that I've got, I'm a part of the best moment in AFL history. And if we did a survey, I think I would come out yeah, on top. I think you probably would too. I mean, how can a guy with chicken legs, yeah. legs that thin, even play AFL, oh, AFL and, football, let alone copy hit like that? And win five day, five night. And, <laughs> and he'll tell you. And, oh, yeah. I know. He's around the corner, starting in a minute. But, uh, yeah, that well. was easily the best moment.